It's time to play Family Feud. Get up for Steve Harvey. I appreciate everybody. Well, welcome to Family Feud, everybody. I'm your man, Steve Harvey. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we're turning for our third day with a total of 20,000. 741 bucks from Rosewell, Georgia. It's the champs. It's the Ron family. And from Indianapolis, Indiana, it's the Shaver family. Everybody see you trying to win ourselves a lot of cash in the shop. Drive out here in a brand new car. Let's play the feud. Let's get it on. Give me, give me Kim. Give me Daphne. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Top seven answers on the board. Name an activity during which you get bored and sleepy. Watch TV, watch TV. Pass the play. We're gonna play, Steve, we're gonna play. Mm. Kelly, name an activity during which you get bored and sleepy. I'm gonna say read, read. Dave, name an activity during which you get bored and sleepy. Speech, speech. Daphne, I mean, excuse me. Debbie, name an activity during which you get bored and sleepy. Study, study. Barb, name an activity during which you get bored and sleepy. Board game, board game. Name an activity during which you get bored and sleepy. Sporting event, sporting event. One answer left. Name an activity during which you get bored and sleepy. Eat, eat. Only one strike, Kelly. Name an activity during which you get bored and sleepy. I mean, excuse me, two strikes. One, only one strike now, Dave. I'm going to say um, in church. In church? Mm -hmm. Let's move on to question two. Give me Kelly, give me Nick. Mm -hmm. Okay. Top eight answers on the board. Name a place where you see people constantly checking the time. School, school. Hospital, hospital. Pass the plate, we're gonna pass, we're gonna pass. Mm. Hello, how are you doing? I'm doing good, Steve. Introduce your family. This is my husband, Nick, my brother, Seth, my cousin-in-law, Travis, and my brother-in-law, Oscar. Seth, name a place 
where you see people constantly checking the time. Um, work, work. Set, uh, Travis, name a place where you see people constantly checking the time. Mall, mall. Oscar, name a place where you see people constantly checking the time. Library. Library. Only one strike. Name a place where you see people constantly checking the time. Bus stop. Bus stop. Nick, name a place where you see people constantly checking the time. Train station. Train station? Seth, name a place where people, where where you see people constantly checking the time. Police station. Police station. Two strikes. Wrong family can steal. I'm going to say fire station. Fire station. Mm. Name a place where you see people constantly checking the time. Airport. Airport. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see number seven. Church. Ron family 155. Shaver family not on the board, but hey, goal is 300 points. Don't go away, so we're coming right back. Welcome back to Family Feud, everybody. We got a good one. Ron Family 155. Shaver Family not on the board. Give me Dave. Give me Seth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Point values are double. Top six answers on the board. Name something a woman sees that will make her tell her husband. Diamond. Diamond. Seth, I'll read your entire question. Name something a woman sees that will make her tell her husband to stop the car. Accident. Accident. Pass the play. We're going to play, Steve. We're going to play. Hmm. Travis, name something a woman sees that will make her tell her husband to stop the car. Person, person. Name something a woman sees that will make her tell her husband to stop the car. Speeding, speeding. Only one strike now. Name something a woman sees that will make her tell her husband to stop the car. I'm going to say there. Animal, animal. All right. I'm going to say altercation, altercation. Two strikes. Ron family can steal. I'm going to say there. Three seconds. Name something a woman sees that will make her tell her husband to stop the car. Sail, sail. Number five. Money.
Ron Family 249, Sheriff Family now on the board. Still anybody's game, we'll be right back. Close captioning is sponsored Popeye. Welcome back to Family Feud, everybody. We got a good one. Ron Family 249, Shaver Family not on the board. Give me Debbie, give me Travis. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Point values are triple. Top four answers on the board. Name something at church a man might have in his pocket in case he gets bored. Phone, phone. Pass the play. We're gonna play, Steve. We're gonna play. Mm. Well, Oscar, name something at church a man might have in his pocket in case he gets bored. Radio, radio. Name something a church a man might have in his pocket in case he gets bored. Book, book. One answer left. Name something a church a man might have in his pocket in case he gets bored. Candy, candy. Mm -hmm. Nobody reached 300 points. Time to play sudden death. Give me Barb. Give me Oscar. All right. With this survey, we're asking for the top answer only. Whoever get this one answer will win the game. Good luck to both of you. Here we go. And something most men lost as they get older. Their leg. Their leg. Hair. Hair. Mm. Mm Proud of you. All right, two people, fast money. Let's go. I got Kim and I got Dave. We'll be right back to play fast money from twenty thousand dollars. Stay with us. All right, you ready? Ready. Twenty seconds on the clock. Time is after I start after I read his first question. Give me a word that rhymes with bubble, trouble. Name something that women like to hold, baby. Tell me a phrase that starts with the word get to, get to work. Name an activity that is hard to do when you have stiff neck, driving. Name something that starts with a letter C that men don't like to do, chores. Turn around. Mm. Here we go. Give me a word that rhymes with bubble, you said. Trouble, survey said. Ding. Name something that woman like to hold, you said. Baby, survey said. Tell me a phrase that starts with the word get to, you said. Get to work, survey said. Ding. Yeah. Name an activity that is hard to, to do when you have stiff neck, you said. 
driving survey said. Yeah. Name something that starts with the letter C that men don't like to do, you said. Chores, survey said. Kim, Dave got 172 points. Yes, you need 28 right now. I actually saying five questions. Don't duplicate the answer. You do, you're going to hear this sound. Uh -uh. I'll say try again. Here, another answer. A little tough this time. We give you 25 seconds. You ready? Minds everybody of Dave's answers. 25 seconds on the clock. Times after I start after I read his first question. Give me a word that rhymes with bubble. Stubble. Name something that women like to hold. Money. Tell me a phrase that starts with the word get to. Get to it. Name an activity that is hard to do when you have stiff neck. Exercise. Name something that starts with letter C that men don't like to do. Clean. Turn around. We are 28 points. Give me a word that rhymes with bubble. You said. Stubble. Survey said. Trouble was the number one answer. Name something that woman like to hold, you said. Money. Survey said. Baby and child was number one. Get to work was number one answer. Driving was number one answer. Clean was the number one answer. Five dollars a point. Three hundred and sixty-six bucks. That's your three-day total. Forty thousand three hundred and sixty-six bucks. And they're coming back to play Family Feud. I'm Steve Harvey. We'll see you next time, folks.